So my name is uh, Ron Segal. I'm a researcher at the Weizmann Institute of Science, heading a group of about 35 people, both experimental and computational. And my lab studies the role of the microbiome in various um, health and disease uh, settings, uh, incorporating human genetics, the immune system, uh, nutrition, and many other factors, um, taking them into account. Um, and in this particular project, we're applying our expertise in computational biology, which is a powerful approach by which we build models of biological data to examine whether alterations in antibody-mediated immunity is producing some kind of an autoimmune state in chronic fatigue syndrome. We're also investigating whether there's a signature of the gut microbiota antigens, which is evident in people with chronic fatigue syndrome as compared to healthy controls. And there's been evidence in the literature for both autoimmunity and disruptions in the gut microbiota. And we believe that we can bring these powerful tools in order to provide insights into this intersection. And so during the first um, six months of the project, uh, my team and I have been working at the Weizmann Institute of Science in order to develop a high throughput method with a combined library of close to 400,000 human autoantigens and gut microbiota antigens. Um, now that the experimental, experimental system is uh, set up, we'll be analyzing serum samples, blood samples from individuals with chronic fatigue syndrome and healthy controls and we expect to be running that in the coming months and see whether that helps us to shed light um, on this condition.